step. What's up? Look at this little crooked child. This is crooked. That's all right. Y'all gonna be watching me crooked today. This make my nerves bad. What's up, Basil Babes? Child, I'm about to cut at this hair again. I don't like cutting hair. It makes my nerves bad. I used to do hair for a living. And I stayed busy, honey. But when you're trying to please somebody that can't be pleased, baby, I'm like, miss, it looks just like the picture that you showed me. It was too much trying to please other They didn't know what they wanted. Mm-mm, mm-mm. And like, y'all know, I do everybody's hair. No, Heather talking about, well, I need to cut the back of your hair. You, I need to fix it. And you never picked up no clippers before? Mm-hmm. Mm. I don't know. That's, oof. I'll see. I may need to, I may need to take a nap and think about this one. So, I'm about to cut her hair. I told her she needs to find another stylist, but she refuses. You gonna get the same hairdo. I told her to take the stuff out. This is sitting in the sink. Do I need cold and flu medicine to cut her hair? No, I don't, cause I was sick a couple of days ago. I don't why she put this out. Really, I don't know what I be doing. I just be making stuff up as I go along. Don't tell her I said that. She won't know. She sure won't be needing this. You'll find out why she won't need this. She won't be needing this either. This is the old school pig child. She don't, she probably don't even know what this is. Do you know what it is? That's the joint back in the day, honey. Wasn't he so cute? He was cute. I got all kinds of stuff up in that bag, child. Need these. She'll know what these are. Comb. Let me tell you, when you have a comb and it's missing some teeth, honey, that's a comb. That no, that means you've been working, child. Either that or you've been with some beady bead head kids. Go on, sit down. Now she wanna act all shy. What you, what you want? Regular. <laughs> she said she wants the regular. <laughs> Cause we we get on each other's nerves. What's regular? The regular. So you want your sides down and your back down? Down. You want this cut down? Yes. yes. So, child, let me tell you, with her hair. You know, they be saying Becky with the good hair, right? I, I don't wet no hair down. I, I can't do that. That make my nerves bad. I got to see. Ooh, look how the comb just go through that job. That don't happen with my hair. Ooh, this thing be getting stuck. Why you think, <laughs> why you think the teeth are missing up in this thing, child? <laughs> so, <laughs> but you know, let me tell you real quick, real quick, real quick. Quiet, 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 quiet. So you remember I was telling you I was breaking down the story, right? And I said that with the domestic violence and stuff, right? It's really not anything to joke about. There are plenty of services out there for women. I'm going to do a whole vlog about that because it's, it's a serious thing. And I'll try not to be silly, but you know, that's in my DNA. I don't know. I got so many stories up in this head. Sometimes I don't know when we're gonna get to you. Hold on, okay? And I got so many stories up up in this head. It's terrible. I just need to write that book so they can all come out. You just throw them all up out so I can empty up some space. It's like my SD card up in this head is overflowing and I need to get it out and delete some stuff and put it on a paper so I can put more stuff up in here. It's terrible. What was I saying? You didn't cut my hair. Cut your hair? No. So anyway, I was saying, I forgot. 
Oh, the domestic violence piece. This, like I said, there's so many stories that I can tell that has happened to me. I can't make this stuff up. I really can't. So when I was in my relationship, home with three kids, and then they come home from work, and they be like, what did you do today, baby? That's when you want to take your nails and rip your skin <laughs> off with the three-year-old, a four-year-old, and a five-year-old. No, they were all home, so it was probably two, three, and four, because they all 18 months. What did I do all day? Are you serious? Another vlog. So anyway, when we, when I went through my domestic violence thing, honey, he kind of went away for, <laughs> I'm trying to be nice because I don't want to throw anybody under the bus. He had to go away for a year for assault with a weapon. Oh, there's so many stories. <laughs> And so that's when I lost the house and stuff. So what had happened was she, can you see her right here? <laughs> she took, she took the kids and I into her house. So she took all of us into her house. So it was four of us, me and the three kids, cause I lost my house, didn't know what direction. And when she was renting a house, I lost my house cause we owned the house. And when her landlord found out she had all the whole th the schoolhouse rock farm up in her house, he was like, no, no. And then when my husband at the time, when he was released a year later, <laughs> when, he got, when he was done with his visit uh, for the year, uh, I didn't know what a mental state was because you know sometimes when you sit around with nothing to do you be thinking and stuff and plotting stuff and that made my nerves bad so originally she's from Michigan so she was like well let's go to Michigan because <laughs> her nerves were bad too <laughs> baby with my three kids and her kids that was like a tsunami <laughs> we did our year child and that's how we landed up back to Texas because it it was a challenge it was a challenge and so here's the thing people we gonna get to this haircut but here's the thing i felt as though in my heart no matter what i went through with my husband my kids still needed a relationship with their dad so knowing that he was now in texas and had no plans to move him back to brooklyn he was still here we moved back here because I wanted my kids to still, regardless of how I was treated, whatever, that was towards me. That wasn't towards the kids. So that's why I made the decision. We moved back to New York for about a month. And I was like, no, they still need that relationship with their dad. And all the kids are still me and I still don't get breaks. But, um, you know, but the kids need the relationship with their dad. So I'll just leave it at that. Yeah. So let me tell you. And child, with her story, with her kids, that's a whole nother channel. <laughs> Not a vlog. That's she can start her own channel, child. Mm -hmm. Baby. <laughs> Stop. But see, you know, let me tell I tell my business. I'm not gonna tell hers. Don't tell her I said that, but she gets the whole own channel, child. It'll, it'll be better than lifetime television. Better believe me. Stop. I'm not saying that. What, now, what, what do you want with your hair as we digress? Remember, we already talked about what digress means, right? That teacher mode never shuts off, okay? Mm -hmm. Stop. What am I doing? Oh, my God. Don't. What? <laughs> you know what? <laughs> nice. Jeez. She don't know, but I really be giving her a black girl hairdo. But that's okay. <laughs> but that's okay. She, <laughs> <laughs> she keep asking for it. <laughs> That's all I know how to do. <laughs> and baby, 
And I'm serious. I got to do this. And you know when she gets the most compliments? The black guys and the black girls, they're like, ooh, miss, your hair is cute. She be like, thank you, thank you. <laughs> That's when she gets the most compliments. I say, you told my black girl, Carter. <laughs> All right, turn around. So now she gotta wet her hair down. You know how they do, they wet it and y'all wet it and keep it moving, honey. Y'all wake up, put a little water in y'all fabulous. Child, you put some water on some black hair, we gotta sit on the dryer for 99 hours. <laughs> Look at that, just flowing, honey. Mine, mine don't do that. I have to add pieces in order for it to do that. I have to get that silky hair, add me some bangs and stuff, get that silk, and I'm, make sure she keeps a little long piece. That's her little treat. That's her treat. Her treat piece. <laughs> That's her treat piece. What I really need to do is cut a chunk out her hair. She won't ever ask me again. Uh, where are you put all these at? In here. <laughs> Fingers 